Hello everyone, my name is Garrett Oakamber, and welcome back to Seven Days to Die. Last time we left off, we went on a little supply run, and um, we had to stay the night here in this town. We got a bunch of goodies, um, and forgive me if I'm a little jerky here trying to figure out how to manage my inventory again, but I've been playing a lot of Minecraft. Whoa! Whoa! Hello there, B. How are you doing? Um, yeah, so I've been playing a, a lot of Minecraft. Hey, we can pick up broken glass. It's awesome. Um, don't really have a use for it right now. Oh, there are zombies up here. Oh, we might be in a bit of trouble. <laughs> Hello there! Oh, get out! Oh, oh god. Oh. No, we don't need to jump out. We don't need to jump out. Hey! Buckstabba! Here we go. Uh... <laughs> So, yeah, we're going to head... She's wedging me in a wall. That's not nice. You don't do that. Oh, you're made of wood. Okay, she's dead. We're alive, and she's dead -er again. Uh, I would like those. Thank you. Can I quickly do that? I'm just going to drop these in here. I don't need those. Feathers! Hey. Okay. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to resist the temptation to jump down there. Um, so we're gonna... We can jump through this window. People are like, oh, I want to see you jump! Wow, windows are durable now. What the hell? Okay. That's new. Ah, oh, the bee despawned. Okay, so there's a whole lot of zombies around here. But I felt we've uh, done a good job and cleared out a few... We're going to head back up top and manage our base because, you know, we 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 went out here just to just to grab things and we 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 I don't know what I'm talking about. Um yeah. We got stuff, we killed zombies and quite a few actually. Um got a lot of supplies, got some guns, ammo and things. Okay. Um, hi. How are you? Are you gonna try to eat me? No, you're not, because you're slow. Haha! Uh -huh. You're very slow. There's your pig in the road. Hello, pig. Goodbye. <laughs> What's this deer doing? He's just in the road with the pig. Tempted to smack him in the butt with a shiv, but we gotta stop doing that. It's not healthy. And if we're not eating them, there's no point. I've got some uh, boiled pork on me, which is good. Mm -mm. Delicious. Oh! Wow, I zoned out there for a moment looking at that pork. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, yeah, let's not do that again. Uh, I've been very overtired lately, uh, trying to recover from being ill those few weeks ago, and all that stuff and also playing a variety of new games he doesn't see us in the face ah. yeah there we go can I there we go I wanted to search him and it's like just being weird home sweet home so what are we gonna do I think we need to work on the outside defenses a bit more um, probably board up those windows tonight not that it's going to do me any good, but it's something. We cut down a whole lot of wood beforehand, but I would very much like to use most of that if I can. We need to make a mine, too. That's something we need to do. Um, there's a lot of things. <laughs> I'll say it, you know, I've said it plenty of times when you're alone in this game. Tasks can take you several days to accomplish. And it's a matter of... Well, I don't want to go that high, but whatever, we'll do it. It's fine. Um, so it's going to take you a while to actually get tasks accomplished. I didn't mean to do that either, but it's okay. And they're going to knock down that door the moment they see it. Here she comes to ruin the day. And we hit her door. Stab you in the teeth. 
right. Enough zombies! I am trying to work! So we're gonna build this up one more layer because I accidentally put a block down and I'm just frankly too lazy to chop it back down. Um, but that being said, I wanted to add a anti-spider zombie rim to this and I don't know if I'll have enough wood now. So let's find out. Yeah, it's looking pretty bad. Pretty sure I'm gonna run out. <laughs> this kind of looks like a medieval fort. The way I've uh, set it up, it's like, Hey, welcome to ye old Yorkshire. Buy things from us, and we will be happy. Not really. I'd be most depressed. Hey, actually, we did have enough. Okay. My math is bad. <laughs> um... So that won't stop them, but it will stop, you know, for the most part, it will stop the spider zombies from getting here, this front entrance. And hopefully that's where most of them will be attracted to, um, whether or not, you know, that will make a difference, I don't know. And we're just going to add this temporary little viewer dingy. Um, this is good, this is good. Also, I don't know, again, if the light actually causes zombies to converge now. I, that was not in the notes, but if it does, we have more stuff to block it. Um, okay, I would very much like to attempt... We don't need that. I would very much like to attempt to start a mine, but without explosives early on... That is going to be an issue. Um, so, where do we start a mine? I'd say the best spot would be right here in the main foyer area. I'm just going to move those up. And we forgot to search these. Um, I don't remember searching them. Hey, we got tuna! Tuna! Alright. So I'm going to chop these bricks out. Oh, they're apparently made of wood. <laughs> wood. Why are they made of wood, though? Why are they made of wood? That's what I want to know. How are these wood? <laughs> okay. Well, that one was... Range. I think that was made of stone. Yeah, that one's made of stone. But this one is made of wood. Well, it's durable, right? Okay, uh, we need to make ladders. Ladders. That's not how I actually say that, but... We're saying it now, because I can. Ladders! Ladders! Whatever. And it is getting slightly late. I'm not concerned again. I'm, I'm doing fine. We're doing absolutely fine here. Um, we just gotta keep this momentum up. Try our best not to get caught. And that unfortunately means when I'm digging and doing all this management, I have to be very careful of sounds. And I think we can actually just put this back here since we're gonna be adding ladders. Um, hmm. That is made of dirt. <laughs> uh, can I put something away so I can smack it? I could have just smacked it with a flashlight. That's true. But we're not going to do that. Damn it! We got a shovel. Let's use it. We're being a dingus. We've got a shovel. We can do this. Smack it. That's made of stone. Stone falling down makes a lot of sound. Ah. 
Okay, so we have to actually dig out this way. This isn't deep enough for iron, but it's a start. Oh. Come on. There we go. Oops. Um. <laughs> We're having some technical uh, difficulties here. Trying to dig a hole that I've done a billion times. Okay. Oh my god. How did we end up on this side? I don't know. I have no words for this. <laughs> uh, mm, what did we do? What did we do? Why? Why would you put that there? Okay, so I got myself out of the hole. Um, the ladder refused to work the way I wanted it to. So I just barely was able to glitch past the ladder there. We still got some meat on here. We've got an extra cooking pot. If I remember correctly. Yes, we do. We can put that away. Um, got some stuff we can eat. Nom, 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 nom. A farm would be nice. And I do have some dirt. We're going to go out and quickly get some dirt. Before it gets dark. I don't think I'll be able to make a farm anytime soon, but... We at least have the option available. I mean, theoretically, I could make a farm as soon as possible. I do need a bucket. Did I make a bucket? I don't recall making a bucket. Hey, bunny! How are you? I'm gonna dig you a little bunny. No, I'm kidding. I'm not gonna dig the bunny. We've already done enough silly things with creatures in this playthrough. Um, we're going strong, though. Okay, I'm in desperate need of water. Got a lot of blueberries. That's going to be our primary crop for now. At some point, we will stop by the farm. And try to grab a bit of corn. This corn is delicious and awesome. We're kind of being wasteful here. I should really smash the grass while we do this. But... I'm a simple farmer. Hey, buddy. What are you up to? I'm digging a hole. Come here. <laughs> yeah, you better run. Okay. Um, hmm. We're going to grab more of these because we're going to be probably mining at some point. If we can help it during the night. I just, I'm worried about mining at night. Um... They said they changed the way actions and stealth work. You're supposed to be able to dig while you're sneaking. But the mini-map, you know, doesn't really... It doesn't really show us being as stealthy as they have us believe. And this is a nice little burial plot. If we die, we can just bury ourselves here. We'll drag our corpse, we'll lay face down the mud, and we'll die. Yeah, what I was saying was, um... They say that you can be more stealthy now. With everything. I don't really believe that. <laughs> I don't believe it. We've seen to the contrary. Oh, spam. Thank you. Shouldn't have. Uh, I'm going to reload my crossbow. And it is going to be dark fairly shortly. So we're going to head indoors. Close the door! No! <laughs> Keep it closed. Okay. So they have no idea where we live still. At least the surviving zombies have no idea. I don't like the fact that I can hear a spider zombie fairly close by. That kind of uh, makes me a little nervous. Yeah, as you can see, I had a bit of trouble. No. Oh, dig. At Fine. You want to be this way? You want to be this way? We'll be this way. I don't know why it wasn't letting me place the ladders on the other side here. There. You happy? Digging in the wrong direction. Doesn't matter. It's all ground. Uh, 
I'm going to lose this pickaxe soon, too. Like, we, we haven't even made anything. So we're going to have to find explosives somehow. Yeah, I've only got, like, 33 strikes in this. Um, so what we're going to do... No! Put it... When I try to... when I Literally, whenever I try to put it somewhere, it doesn't let me. <laughs> it always goes in the wrong area. Um, okay. So, we're doing okay. We've got... Uh, what did I just pick up? I wasn't even paying attention. Did I just pick up a painting? Yes, I did, as a matter of fact. I looked down in real life uh, at my keyboard for some reason, and I didn't realize I picked up a painting. Hey, that Mr. Painting, how are you? Um, okay, so we got plenty of uh, water for now. Got food. Got chairs. I don't know what I'm going to use for chairs, so what I think we're going to do... We searched this entire place, didn't we? Yes, we did. Yes, we did. We're going to seal off the bathrooms. We don't need them. I know people are like, oh, you can get water from the bathrooms. I really don't want to do that. If I'm trying to roleplay it, I'm not going to, you know, drink from the toilet. Because, frankly, I wouldn't. <laughs> I just wouldn't. I know the water in toilets is clean. I'm aware of this. But I don't want to, uh... I, I wouldn't do it. It's just it's a matter of comfort, personal comfort. That makes no sense, but hey. We can pull it off. <laughs> um... Yeah. The zombie apocalypse, I'd be pretty much hidden the entire time. That's a beautiful sunset. No, uh, that is a... Is that the moon or is that the sun? I think that's the... It is the sun. Yeah, it's a beautiful sunset. Um, I'd be pretty much hidden the zombie apocalypse. I would not go out much. Only if I was to grab things. I would be as stealthy as possible. I'd basically just be a living ghost. Survivors and zombies alike wouldn't even know I existed. That's really the way to do it. They don't know you exist. You're safe. Um, I got a big, beautiful moon outside. How would you survive in the zombie apocalypse? Let me know in the comments below. What would you guys do to survive the end of the world? If there were zombies, this is pertaining to this situation in particular. If there's just zombies, it doesn't matter if there's nuclear radiation, it doesn't matter if, I don't know, some weird disease mutates. Let's just say, end of the world by zombies, how would you survive? What would you do? How would you live? I know a lot of people, when they play these games, they have the notion that they would become, you know, a bandit and be all badass and shoot people and kill stuff. Let me tell you the truth. Just because the world's gone to shit doesn't mean you're going to change who you are. That That's a simple fact. It doesn't matter the circumstance. You're still going to be who you are. We actually tend to rise up when we are faced with adversity. Human beings tend to become exactly who they are supposed to be in the moment that it's needed the most. I've been through several traumas in my life, and I've ended up helping people time and time again. So, I, I'm saying, yeah, oh, I'm going to be a you know stealthy person. No one's ever going to know I'm there. To, to, yeah, to be fair, I'm going to try my best to be stealthy if, you know, shit like this happens. But, frankly, if, um, I, if someone's in trouble and I'm there, I, I can't, I, I can't, comp I can't resist my, comp my, I'm compelled to help people. And that's who I am. Whether it's a fault or boon. I don't know. So, who would you be? Who do you think you'd be? <laughs> be honest. Be fun. Be friendly. Would you be the giant chicken smacker of doom and throw turkeys at people? Literally, I'm sure there'd be a few crazies, but hey, it's a zombie apocalypse. Everyone else is dead. So, we are gonna get to work on a forge. Um, we are literally missing just a small amount of stone. And... Regrettably... I cannot... Oh, man. We need stone if we're gonna do this. I hate to do this. 
but I'm gonna go outside and grab just two things of stone. We literally only need one, but if I can come across two, it'd be great. Um, this could be a very bad idea. Or this could be the craziest ninja shit you've ever seen. Uh, oh, oh, oh. oh this light is giving me some false confidence. <laughs> Oh boy. It's so quiet too, that's the worst part. I can't even see, it's so dark. So we're just sneaking across the street. And again, I'm unsure if this light will let them know we're here. As it wasn't in the patch notes. There's no reason to believe that. Let's just grab some more. Ooh. Oh, screw that, screw that. I think we have enough. I think we have enough. Uh, let's see. Forge, 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 forge. Oh, I have to craft it. No! Please don't make any sound. Oh, we can make it. Okay, let's head back in. I fell in a hole. Oh, it's very foreboding. This atmosphere is very foreboding. Um, hey, we can see better when we hold the scope. I don't know why that is, but... There's... A deer over there. Alright, we're gonna... Head back inside. Oh... They're attacking deer. Don't lead them over here, deer. You bad deer. See him out there? On the mini map? He's running around in front of my house. It's not very good. Uh, damn. That's a little nerve wracking. Okay. So, I can actually create a forge now. And we can start making iron ingots, which is essential to our survival at this point. I've had to resort to burning ladders, uh... Oh, uh, that's not even enough. That ain't good. <laughs> um, damn. We didn't have enough wood left over. So, shit. Maybe I can burn a chair? I don't know. I don't think I can. Uh, so that's one piece of iron that was finished. That's good, but it's not what we wanted. Did I store any wood? I don't think I did. We've been using wood so much, and I don't really think I have any wood stockpiles. Do I have any wood stockpiles? <laughs> no, probably not. We're not going to burn these barricades. We need these for windows. Oh, we're gonna need wood in the morning. That's what we need. Yeah, got some dirt. So I had dirt already. I didn't really need to go out and dig any, but pick up some more dirt. We've got some books, but we are not gonna burn books because we need that. Nor paper. Um, where did I put the dirt? Dirt is over here. Da 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 da. No, 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 no. Let's try to organize. I'm sorry, I get the same way about um, people's organizations in games. Like, I, I'll watch the Oxcast, for instance, play their Minecraft stuff, and I get so. Te like, I get this tedious thing, this pang, just watching them play because they, they leave stuff out or. They're not organizing things. They're not building the best way they should. And I'm sorry, I've, I've got OCD. I can't watch a show and be like, "Oh, they forgot to do that." And yeah, I feel I I totally feel that that pain. Um, so if you guys are watching me, and you know, you're like, "Oh, no, he's got he's he's not stacking things properly or whatever." I'm sorry. <laughs> I just can't help it sometimes. 
it comes down to comfort versus, you know, your, your conform conformity. Um, everything can't be perfect. That's the truth of it. I guess if you really try, you can make things perfect. But truly, when it comes down to it, you know, just just play the way you can play. At the moment, at the present time. Why do I jump out of windows and I could clearly use a ladder? Frankly, because I just don't want to be in that area and get killed by a zombie. <laughs> That's the reason. Um, so I'm going to end this episode here. And this is a more relaxed episode. There wasn't a lot of action going on. Um, hoping you guys enjoyed this. If you, you know, really like what you see, you know, leave a like, comment, subscribe. Uh, tell your friends, tell your family. Um, and a deer's getting killed outside the window. That's not good. Oh, I don't like when they get that close. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and uh, looking forward to more updates soon enough. Alpha 8 is on the horizon already. Um, yeah, thanks for watching.